Hey guys, it's Carrie. I'm showing lots of my sharks, crustaceans, and some of my new sea animals at the end. Crustaceans include crabs, lobsters, and shrimp. Sharks have a skeleton made of cartilage with five to seven gill slits on the side of the head and pectoral fins that are not fused to the head. A lot of sharks are apex predators. Goblin shark, they are benthopelagic creatures. Their soft, semi-translucent skin has a rough texture from a covering of dermal denticles, each shaped like a short upright spine and lengthwise ridges. Clawed lobster, they are ten-legged creatures just like shrimps and crabs. Clawed lobsters have claws and inhabit cold waters. The lobster molds its shell each year to grow a new larger one. The shell cannot expand in size as the lobster grows. Lobsters without shells are easy prey and they usually hide until a new shell grows. Please subscribe, like and turn on notifications. Spiny Lobster They have long antennas instead of claws and they will be found in tropical warmer waters. Blue Crab To defend themselves they use their sharp front pincers. Crabs have eyes on stalks just like snails. King Crab They are a taxon of decapod crustaceans, chiefly found in cold seas. Dungeness Crab They have a wide, long, hard shell which they must periodically molt to grow. Hermit Crab as they continue to grow, they need to find larger shells to live in. They are omnivores and eat pretty much anything they can find in the surrounding water. They are mainly found in coastal waters where there is more food and places to hide. Mako shark, they are the fastest shark and one of the fastest fish on the planet with top speeds of 75 kilometers per hour. It is able to leap out of the water when hunting. Blue shark is another one of the fastest fish with its sleek tapered body that is made for fast swimming and quick turns. Tailfin moose from side to side propelling the shark along. It will pursue its prey for long distances. Thresher's shark, they are known for slaying their prey with their huge tails and are famous for special jumping techniques and behaviour. Tiger's shark, females mate once every three years. They breed by internal fertilization. The male inserts one of his claspers, which is like a penis, into the female's genital opening, called a cloaca, acting as a guide for the sperm. The male uses his teeth to hold the female still during the procedure, often causing the female considerable discomfort. The tiger shark is the only species in its family that is ovoviviparous. Its eggs hatch internally 
and the younger born life when fully developed. The vertical stripes are found mainly on younger sharks and fade as they mature. Their powerful jaws have sharp, highly serrated teeth that can even crack the shells of sea turtles and clams. They can grow up to seven and a half meters and are found in tropical and subtropical waters throughout the world. The whale shark is the largest fish in the sea, about 12 meters long. It is a filter feeder. It feeds near the surface by filtering water through its massive jaws. Its favorite food is plankton. The whale shark's flattened head has a blunt snout above its mouth with the short barbels protruding from the nostrils. Megamouth shark is the smallest of the three extant filter feeding sharks alongside the whale shark and basking shark. Basking shark, it is the second largest living shark and fish after the whale shark and is also a filter feeder. It has a greatly enlarged mouth and highly developed gill rakers. Its snout is conical. Hammerhead shark. It is a very unusual looking shark. They use their white set eyes to give them a better field of vision. They use their cephalofoil for sensory reception, maneuvering and prey manipulation. The cephalofoil gives the shark superior binocular vision and depth perception. The cephalofoil helps them even find stingrays buried in the sand. The mouth is located on the underside of the head. It has sharp, triangular and serrated teeth. The largest hammerhead can grow up to 6 metres. Sally Lightfoot Crab. They feed on algae, plant matter and dead animals. It is a quick moving and agile crab and hard to catch. Sand Tiger Shark. They hunt by stealth. It is the only shark known to gulp air and store it in the stomach, allowing the shark to maintain near neutral buoyancy. Bull shark, they can thrive in both salt and fresh water and can travel far up rivers. Their name comes from the shark's stocky shape, broad flat snout and aggressive unpredictable behaviour. They are diadromous, meaning they can swim between salt and fresh water with ease. The bull shark is one of the few cartilaginous fishes that have been reported in freshwater systems. Bull sharks in freshwater possess several organs with which to maintain appropriate salt and water balance. These are the rectal gland, kidneys, liver and gills. All elasmobranchs have a rectal gland which functions in the excretion of excess salts accumulated as a consequence of living in seawater. Therefore, bull sharks in freshwater environments decrease the salt excretory activity of the rectal gland to conserve sodium and chloride. Their diet consists mainly of bony fish and small sharks, including other bull sharks and stingrays. Shrimp or prawn. They have narrow muscular tails, long whiskers or antennae and slender legs. Megalardin. It probably had a major impact on the structure of marine communities. The fossil record indicates that it had a cosmopolitan distribution. 
it targeted large prey such as whales, seals and sea turtles. Juveniles inhabited warm coastal waters and fed on fish and small whales. Unlike the Greek white, which attacks prey from the soft underside, Megalodon probably used its strong jaws to break through the chest cavity and puncture the heart and lungs of its prey. It would have faced competition from whale-eating cetaceans such as Liviatin and other macro-reptorial sperm whales and possibly smaller ancestral killer whales. As the shark preferred warmer waters, it is thought that oceanic cooling associated with the onset of the ice ages coupled with a lowering of sea levels, prey being less abundant, may have contributed to its decline. The shark's extinction coincides with a gigantism trend in baleen whales. Great white shark. It is an apex predator and it has no natural predators other than on the very rare occasions the orca. It is the world's largest known extant macro predatory fish and is one of the primary predators of marine mammals up to the size of a large baleen whale. This shark is also known to prey upon a variety of other marine animals, including fish and seabirds. Great whites live in almost all coastal and offshore temperate waters. It is an epipelagic fish, observed mostly in the presence of rich game, such as fur seals, sea lions, cetaceans, other sharks and large bony fish species. Although considered a coastal shark, it has been recorded at depths as great as 1,200 metres. Red Seahorse they have a segmented body armour, an upright posture and a curled prehensile tail. This one's carrying one of the young. Blue Sea Dragon is a species of blue sea slug, a pelagic aeolid nudibranch, a shellless gastropod. Blue Ringed Octopus are one of the world's most venomous marine animals despite their small size, which is 12 to 20 centimetres. They are very dangerous to humans when handled. Ichthyosaurus had dozens of sharp needle-like teeth and used them to catch squid or other kind of mollusks. Cretoxyrhina is an extinct genus of large mackerel shark, it was a formidable predator in the late Cretaceous seas. I love to read your comments and will always reply. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.